Martin Roberts told his followers he has a job to do, as he arrived close to a bomb site in order to offer aid to war-torn Ukraine. The homes under the hammer presenter, 58, has spent recent days on a lengthy journey from the UK to the Poland-slash-Ukraine border with supplies, a trek that took him over 26 hours in total. Since Russia forces invaded their neighboring country last month, many Ukrainians have been forced to flee their homeland and seek refuge in other countries. Updating his fans on Monday morning, property expert Martin revealed his had finally arrived at the border after Sunday's mammoth drive. Announcing his arrival at one of the coordination points, the DIY guru gave his followers an emotional tour of a drop-off area, where volunteers are working tirelessly to help those impacted by Vladimir Putin's senseless attacks on Ukraine. In the first update, prior to arriving, the BBC star confessed he was approaching the final part of his journey with a certain amount of trepidation, nervous about the horrors he will see being so close to a recently bombed area. So today is the day I go to the Ukrainian border. I'm filled with purpose but a certain amount of trepidation, he captioned a video update shared to his Instagram account on Monday morning. I'm sure I'm going to see things that break my heart. And I'm going just 20 kilometers away from where they bombed yesterday. But I have a job to do. In the clip, Martin revealed he had been driving from 8 a.m. on Sunday morning until in the early hours of Monday morning, but after a few hours sleep, was ready to deliver the much-needed supplies. Just a couple of hours after posting his first social media update, the Homes Under the Hammer presenter revealed he had safely completed the final leg of his mammoth threat. Showing his followers around the camp, at one point he confessed it was the little things that made him emotional. It's the little things that get you though, he explained as he walked towards a collection of children's toys. This is kind of like a reception they come into and one of the first things you come across is this huge pile of kids' bags and toys that have been donated. So hopefully the kids come in here and the first thing they can do is maybe pick up a little bag which has been donated by people. Martin then went on to explain that he was waiting for the person he will be giving the medical supplies to and said the plan is to then move on to drop off additional donations to other centers. It just really brings it home, doesn't it? Martin emotionally stated as he wrapped up his video update. In the wake of Russia's invasion, generous Britons have donated vital supplies and money for the thousands of Ukrainian refugees arriving across the border. Following appeals for help as families flee their homes in Kyiv and other major cities, there has been a massive outpouring from people wanting to help out, including Martin and many other celebrities. Speaking at the 2022 BAFTAs on Sunday night, actor Benedict Cumberbatch pledged to do all he can to help Ukrainian refugees, including opening up his home to some. It's estimated 2.5 million people have fled the country since President Vladimir Putin ordered Russian forces to invade their neighboring country on February 24, 2022.
Everyone needs to do as much as they can, there's been a record number of people volunteering to take people into their homes, I hope to be part of that myself, Benedict told Sky News on the red carpet before the star-studded event. On Friday, Technology Minister Chris Philp said the details of plans to allow Ukrainian refugees to come and stay with British families will be set out in the very near future. He told Sky News, we're going to be making announcements in the very near future about a scheme for UK local authorities, and indeed UK families, to welcome Ukrainian refugees. We've announced that principle and the details of how that scheme works will be laid out in the very near future. Want all the latest news and analysis from Ukraine? Sign up to our World News Bulletin here.